from the West Coast, the West Coast team, with Angel as her advisor and inspiration, Kevin Sullivan and Mark Lewin. Their opponents this evening, Mad Dog Buzz Sawyer and the Maniac Matt Bourne with Percy Pringle now in her corner advising and managing them. Brock Lubitsch, your referee. Hold on, we are underway already. Bourne and Sullivan and Sawyer on Lewin. Angel leaps to the floor. Percy Pringle is out here in his black and white star jacket. And this bout is underway. We'll bring it all, bring you all of it that we can. It might be all of it because we've got about 12 minutes of TV and it's only a 15 minute time limit, so we have a great chance of seeing it all. Mad Dog Sawyer now squares off as the legal man on Mark Lewin. This is second round action. The Lewin Sullivan team defeated the Battens. Mike and Kevin Von Eric were defeated by the Bourne Sawyer team. Percy Pringle is their manager, remember. Angel is here as Jim Lund gets his wish. Lewin, as Angel looks on. Ooh, a mysterious lady, and she does not want to be on TV. Sawyer on Kevin Sullivan. To the eyes goes Sullivan, and here comes Lewin again. Lewin with a chop. Mark Lewin, the purple haze man. Chris Adams telling us about that. I'm like Chris. I don't know what the meaning of that is. Mad Dog Sawyer, a guy who has been getting some severe anger out of the fans. His behavior with the fans, his behavior with the wrestlers in the ring, his chain. A dangerous individual. And now Mad Dog Sawyer is biting on the arm of Kevin Sullivan. Here's Maniac Mad Bourne. Bourne with the arm over the head. This bout is too close to call as to who will win this. Remember, next week here on Channel 11, you will see World Heavyweight Title Action. That bout has yet to take place for the crowd that's here tonight. As well as the rest of this World Tag Team Tournament. The finals in the winning team. How many bouts we've had so far tonight with what's happened on TV and what has happened otherwise, but the fans are gonna get to see a lot more head into the knee keep your eye on angel she doesn't want to be on tv which makes me a little leery of what she might do and if this sullivan lewin team were to win this tournament then we are going to see a lot of angel as they defend this belt with world class jim lund says we already see quite a bit of her and that is the truth you saw her reaching up with those long fingernails Percy chasing her away. Here they go around the ring and they have got Angel. Mad Dog Sawyer chasing Angel around. That woman ain't got no business out here. You better get her out of here. Hey, you Jezebel, you. You better get her right there where you belong. Ooh, Angel is not backing away from Percy Pringle. Her hands there where I cannot describe. Oh, my. Now, in the meantime, they've got the stairway on the other side of the ring. Sullivan is on board. Sawyer got thrown into a post over there a minute ago. Lewin is on him in the ring. Angel is after Percy Pringle, and Percy runs from Angel. Madborn throwing the stairway around over there as Percy runs from Angel. Lewin is on Sawyer, and now he's on board going to the eyes. Many of the fans standing as this bout really heats up. That Angel Percy confrontation would be a beauty. It would be all for naught, though, with Percy, I'm afraid. Here's Bourne. 
Mark Lewin throwing Bourne all the way out to the feet of the ringside fans. Bourne back up. He's going after Angel. Angel over there looking at him. Bourne is reaching for. Sullivan reaches out to grab him. Angel is about to come out of that outfit. Five minutes. Five minutes by Joe Rinelli as the nerve class is on Matt Bourne by Mark Lewin, a class that we saw Lewin use in our very first bout on the U.S. Express. Order somewhat restored now by referee Bronco Lovich as Lewin is on Bourne. As Sullivan talks to Angel, and there's Sawyer coming in with an illegal kick to the rib cage. Lewin shaking his head like he doesn't know what's happening. Mad Dog Sawyer about featuring the loonies. Lewin backing off. Here's the tag for Kevin Sullivan. Keep your eye on Angel there in the lower left as the referee stance is applied. Sawyer up in the near side ropes. Here comes Angel, I think. I saw Sullivan motion over there for her. There she is. Oh, she's going at uh, Sawyer across the head. Now Sawyer reaches out and grabs Angel. There comes Bourne fighting her off. Oh, and Mark Lewin just nailed Matt Bourne to the concrete, and here goes Lewin after him. Here's Sullivan being thrown to the floor by Mad Dog Sawyer. Lewin has got Bourne. Here they go. They're out there, and Bourne is thrown into that little steel pole that holds the restraining rope. Sawyer is smashed by Sullivan. Here's Angel around again, standing behind Lewin. Sullivan grabs Bourne, throws him away, goes back after Sawyer. Lewin now has got that pole I was talking about. And it has that little restraining rope that goes right in front of the ringside fans. Bronco Lewin wants that back out. Look out, Lewin has his head smashed into the top of that pole. That is steel. That is anchored down by a tire and a wheel, and Bronco throws that back up. What a mess. Here's Sullivan into a clothesline by Mad Dog Buzz Sawyer. Big elbow by Bellowing Sawyer. Only for one. Boy, Angel sure got Percy to settle down. He not done anything. Clothesline by Kevin Sullivan. Here's the tag for Lewin. Chop to the neck. There's Angel looking on. Percy, very vociferous in the early stages. Ooh, look at her. Percy now getting wound up. You could just see a glimpse of him back there. There he is. His attention has been on Angel for much of this bout. Mad Dog Sawyer rakes his hands across the back of Mark Lewin. Sawyer biting on Lewin. The battle of the instabilities here with these men. More convention center excitement for you next Saturday night here at Channel 11. Big slam by Matt Bourne. He comes outside and climbs the ropes. Bourne is high. Down! But Lewin is out of the way. Kevin Sullivan now in. Monday night, a big card. Will Rogers Coliseum. Sullivan with a pin. One, two...
Lance Von Erich and Chris Adams tag team against Mark Lewin and the Dingo. Mad Dog Sawyer defends against Brian Adias for the Texas title. Matt Bourne versus Kevin. Watch the pile driver by Lewin. One, two, and that's all as Sawyer comes in illegally. Abdullah versus Zulu Monday. Be with us at 8 o'clock. Friday night, it's the Sawyer $10,000 match with Chris Adams and much more. The Sportatorium as Bourne knocks Sullivan off his feet. Mark Lewin and the Dingo against Rick Rude and Joe Laduke in a big Sportatorium main. Ten minutes, ten. Ten minutes called by Joe Rinelli as this bout continues. We're beginning to run out of time for this Saturday night telecast. Here's Lewin back in. Chopped to the head on Matt Bourne. I'm excited about the Sportatorium and Will Rogers action this week. Be with us in force and in person. Nothing like being here in person. It adds an extra dimension to your enjoyment. Sullivan over with the chops on Sawyer, who darts under the rope, now goes after him, rolls him up. There will be no pin because he's not the legal man as Lewin comes in. Percy, I still remind you of Percy being very quiet since Angel chased him off. But it's been a night for the Pringle dynasty, the big announcement of his coup as Rick Rude and Joe LaDuke not only have Rude as, or uh, Percy as their manager, but also Mad Dog Sawyer and Maniac Matt Bourne in the Pringle regime as well. Matt Bourne and Kevin Sullivan here in the second round of this World Tag Team Tournament, head in the turnbuckle. Big crowd looking on here at the Tarrant County Convention Center. Sullivan over on Sawyer. Lewin getting ready over here. There he is with the chop. Lewin is not the legal man. Bronco Lewis never saw a tag and wants him out. Here comes Sullivan back. There's Angel looking on. A lovely and seductive lady. She does not like that camera though. Well, we're running low on time. It's been a memorable night here from the Tarrant County Convention Center. For Jim Lund, Stan Hobotter, Doyle King, Joe Rinelli, and our entire crew, thanks for being with us. Hope you have a safe and pleasant week ahead, and good night, everybody.